You know, you know, it's, you know it's so crazy, right? When the brain is really trained to do something, it just kind of sticks to it. You know, I say that to say, man, you know, I, at my heaviest weight, I was like 384, man. I done lost over 160 some pounds. But sometimes I still find myself buying clothes that I used to be able to fit. Then when I get home and try it on, it'd be too damn big. I'd be like, why did I buy this? You know, I went from a 5X to a 2X, you know what I'm saying? I really can fit a 1X, depending on the material sometimes. But it's just crazy how Jalen Smith! You know, at one point we thought this kid and Van Der Esch was gonna be the next top linebacker duo in the NFL. And I feel like uh, a few years back, 2018, they were, man. I really, I really feel like 2018, they were, man. You know, and after that, we just started to see a decline from this kid, man. It's just like, I don't know what happened to him, man. And, um, you know, there, there, were, there have been reports that the Cowboys may try to do something with him. I don't know about, you know, moving him or trying to do restructure thing. And, you know, reported by Mike Fisher, you know, they, they spoke to Jaden personally. And he was like, he ain't heard nothing, you know. So, I, I guess I'm just asking y'all, like, how y'all feel? Restructure, just move on from a period? Because even restructuring, does, that doesn't mean that his production will go up. You know what I'm saying? Just like he's all over the place. Just like he playing backyard football. Like he don't have a, like he don't have a job and he's just running free. You know, so it's crazy. I don't, I don't, I don't understand how that works with Jaden. You know, I don't know how you go from looking like you' about to be that deal to just a complete decline, back to back. Like especially in 2020 was terrible, man. You know, um, so in my opinion, I feel like you can get better production out of somebody else. You know, what I'm saying that, that that may be a little bit more football savvy, smart, smart wise. You know, what I'm saying because he just don't know where to be. Well, he know where to be, he just, like, he don't get, they tell him where to go. Just like, he just don't get there. And, and at this point, like, is it worth it with everything going on with our quarterback? Somebody got to take a pay cut somewhere. You know what I'm saying? So, in my opinion, because I don't think his contract going to fully affect, like, fully guaranteed until March the 9th, if I'm not mistaken. 23rd, I don't know, one of these dates. You know what I'm saying? So, I don't think we will lose too much. You know, this dude get up, he, he can he can fucking somebody can gain nine yards because of his fuck up, and then get tackled and then he's still a swipe. Like last year, he was just like so arrogant at the wrong time. Like this dude was just fucking stupid, man. Like at one point, Jaden was looking like that, like that deal. He looking like he was really, it, it was looking like picking him with that injury paid off in 2018. You know what I'm saying? When we, when we drafted him in 2016, like it started to pay off, but. Now, man, I don't know, man. I, I think I'd be okay with moving on from Jalen, man, to be honest with y'all, man. I think I'd be okay with it, man. Um, contractually, if it made sense, we, we probably could, you know, get something out of it, or I really don't know how it go, but, you know, whatever. I think that they're going to try to do something with him because he, the, the, the productivity just didn't match his, you know what I'm saying, what we gave him last year, you know. So tell me what y'all think in the comments about Jalen Smith, fifth quarter Cowboys. I'll be dropping a video every Friday. You got my word. Every Friday, I'll be dropping a video. I can't guarantee any more days. But other than that, feel free to Cowboys. Subscribe to the channel. Shout out to my bro, Cowboys Corner. Peace.